Hello, hello. It has been a while since I've done a Mark Reviews Places, and I'm standing in the shade of this tree because it's really sunny. I don't want to be squinting on camera. Uh, because today is St. Patrick's Day, I came to the most Irish place in Utah County, which really isn't saying much. Uh, this is O'Crowley uh, Irish Tacos and also Juice Press right here behind me. Uh, so not super uh, authentic Irish food. There's no soda bread in here, no corned beef, no, you know, uh, whatever else you w would equate with uh, Ireland and Irish food. Um, what they do have is a lot of freshness in their food. Um, I ordered the number one combo, which came with two tacos and a fruit salad. And probably the downside to the tacos was the meat. Uh, you have your choice of beef or chicken. Uh, today they were, they were just kind of as you can imagine, an Irish place on St. Patrick's Day, and really the only Irish place on St. Patrick's Day, they were slammed in there. And they were keeping up with the demand, uh, but I think, you know, if anything suffered, it was maybe the meat. I was hoping for more of like a slow-roasted carnitas type thing, and uh, ended up being more like a, I don't know, kind of similar to like a sloppy joe, or like a, like a canned meat almost is how it tasted. However, everything else, fantastic. Uh, the other toppings, the lettuce, cilantro, tomatoes, onions, you know, kind of pico, um, you know, fresh avocado slices and limes. I just thought it was excellent. So if you're in the area, we're right off State Street and uh, you know, right by the border of Linden here. This is the same plaza that has on this corner here, Maggleby's Fresh, and uh, on the opposite corner on this side, woo! kid to kid right behind me so kind of hidden away here in a strip mall next to a tattoo parlor and a mathnasium location uh, but worth checking out I would rate kind of the freshness of their food um, you know the freshness of everything but the meat I, I give it five stars and I thought it was fantastic the meat uh, it was more like a two or three which brings me back down to like a three to four overall um, the location inside not a lot of places to sit down Today is St. Patrick's Day, so they set up extra tables outside, and that's what I ended up having to do. Um, so if you're coming with a large group or something, you're going to be disappointed. There aren't a lot of places to hang out inside. Uh, the bathroom is really awkward to get to and things, but um, if I come back, I'm going to try the, the juice press. Did not try that this time. I feel like I missed out a little bit, but, uh, you know, I, I think you can go pretty healthy here. You can get healthy options. There are also pretty unhealthy things. So the fruit salad, you know, assuming that fruit salad is healthy, right? It's high on the glycemic index, but I would consider fruit salad healthy. This particular one, I swear, had like pudding or something mixed in with Cool Whip or, or whatever their, their whip topping was. Uh, so it was really sweet. It was something more like I would have had in my childhood. Um, you know, and a lot of the the juices that they have in there. It's not a true juice press, it's more like a smoothie place. A lot of the smoothies they have in there have a lot of unhealthy things, you know, chocolate and peanut butter and, you know, you, you just have to be careful. There's a lot of sherbet and things like that. So if you're coming in here specifically for healthy options, you can find them. You can definitely find them, but don't just assume that the whole place is healthy because it says in really big letters on the sign, juice press. It, it, it's not. Uh, so today obviously being St. Patrick's Day I'll cut them some slack for being slow on their service I, Obviously, I wasn't the only one with this idea today uh, But it was kind of slow service. It looks like normally they would just keep right up and there wouldn't be much of a wait So if you're looking for a quick bite to eat and you are in the Linden area check them out We're right off State Street in this uh, strip mall shopping plaza beautiful views of Mount Timpanogos just behind this place and uh, as a parting shot, I'll show you my last remaining taco. Bear with me for a second while I open my to-go box. Okay. There it is. So, it was actually really good. Look how fresh those ingredients look. So, if you're in the area, you're looking for a quick taco, Tacos Al Pastor, kind of like a street taco, is really the style that you're getting here. So. Irish, it's not. Uh, the music, the, the festivities in there on St. Patrick's Day were Irish. I don't know how tacos are Irish, but it was good. Give them a try. 
That'll do it for this Mark Reviews Places. Subscribe to this channel and uh, let me know what you think in the comments below if you've been here, if you haven't, if you're interested, if you're very not, uh, let me know. I'd be interested to hear your opinion as well. And subscribe!